Hello, this is a array example tutorial. In this tutorial, I will discuss how array is used in Visual Basics. Here we use the array and for loop to display the array element. First, we define the element counterpart to display the element of the array. So we define the dim i as a counter as an integer. Then we define the variable array. It can hold three value. And this is a one dimensional array. So one dimensional means it can hold the list of the elements. We can define where array is a variable array name of the variable is 2 it can hold the three values 0 1 and 2 like this one array 0 is 15 and 7 8 because it is an integer type we assigning the integer value if it is a variable string type as a string then we can define the strings various string to the variable and for loop is used for the display the string in message so it is a predefined array element you can enter from input box or input type control to variable array values so let's start how it work When you click, it is a display high and 15 value which is predefined in program, then 7 and 8. Now, string array is now displaying using for loop. John is a very great artist. So, in array, we can run the list of the element so so here is the syntax of the array in next tutorial I will discuss how variable element is entered or how to add the two matrix using the array and for loops um, and two dimensional arrays and one dimensional arrays uh, and three dimensional arrays there are different n dimensional you can define arrays which can add the n dimensional matrix two dimensional three dimensional four dimensional any dimensional you can add the matrix and you can 